The pressure is just overwhelming. I don't want to disappoint John. I don't want him to think that he signed some Disney kid. Selena Gomez breaks down in tears over her struggle to shake off her Disney image. Disney Channel is definitely a machine. They, they obviously care about a show, they want to make it the best, and they give everything they can into one thing and, and each of their projects. Selena starred on the Disney Channel's hit series Wizards of Waverly Place from 2007 to 2012. Bippity boppity, no. <laughs> I'm gonna let them enjoy their Alex Free Day because, because I'm that nice. I worshipped Disney when I was younger, and still to this day, you know, High School Musical and everything, and, and so just to be on their on their network is just a blessing, and I'm thankful. And in her new Apple TV Plus documentary, My Mind and Me, the triple threat gets emotional during a rehearsal for her 2016 revival tour, admitting she's worried her concert feels too young, and it might disappoint the execs that signed her to Interscope Records. That was a moment in 2016. She's getting ready to do her first tour outside the Disney, uh, you know, machine. Uh, and she was at that tender age of 24. But that wasn't the only tear-filled moment Selena had thinking about her past as a child star. To love, love, to love. While promoting her emotional ballad, Lose You to Love Me in 2020, Cell got upset after she felt like an interviewer wasn't listening to her heartfelt answers. I feel like a product. It was like making me angry. You know, you know what it is, is it made me feel like this. It's a trigger. I don't, I, I just like, I've spent years, years of my life trying to not be that. Edge Bono, you too. <laughs> oh, no, that's cool. I look like a witch with the outfit doing it all like the wand again. Whatever, it's fine. But back in June, Selena opened up about life after Disney on the Hollywood Reporter's Awards Chatter podcast and said she's grown from the experience and looking back, she's nothing but appreciative for those years. I am so grateful because everything that I've done, I've earned and I've worked really hard for and I would never replace that for the world. If everything was handed to me, I guarantee you I would be a totally different person. When people even say the whole Disney chapter of my life, you know, oh, do you regret it? Or no, it was hard to kind of move away from it, but it wasn't, it, tr it really did train me. 